going on guys and hello and good half morning i guess it's time fly here and today i just watched a part two and they did a really brilliant job from the first beginning that i like kind of and the second one they did amazing so it is justice league X Ruby Superheroes and Hensman Part 2. So this one is really different. So so the Justice League, you remember the you remember I told you about they become teenagers from part one though, right? So on part so on part two, they returned their homes and they became adults again. I'm like, oh, finally, they're adults again. Yes. But, but I like how they're adults again. But this is so amazing how they become adults again. I got to say, that was perfect. But right now, it was perfect. And then they saw a massive grim. But right now, I just, you know what? I just solved this part when um, Ruby and, you know, I mean, Team Ruby continued their own journey and attacked their own Grim attacks. And then, and then I saw, I then Bruce, and then Bruce as Batman had a had a had a sting on his on his thing you know what i mean on his chest like over here and then he got or here he got hurt and that's why he needs some rest and then he and then oh oh <laughs> sorry after that, they got a phone call. Cyborg contacted them, and then they translated the call. And I'm like, "Wow, this is I'm like this is amazing." And and I'm like, "Oh my gosh!" And there and then Team Ruby they didn't know they were adults, just like from Part One. I mean. For part one, they are teenagers, and then part two, they're all adults. So, I gotta say, they did amazing on part two. So, I like this one. This one is really awesome, though. That is so good. They did a perfect job, though. And I gotta say about this one, this one is great. So... So they talk about, you know, you know, changing the grim and, um, and all this stuff and all of those things. And after that, Team Ruby go to their Justice League world. And, you know, I got to tell you about this part. They change. They change the powers and new outfits. And I'm like, okay. Now that's different. I'm like, okay, that is so new. <laughs> okay, that is so new, but I gotta say that was so new. So, but they're not Kansas anymore. But they have new outfits, new powers, and they have new good looks. And I gotta say, that one was really awesome though. I gotta say, it was really awesome and really cool, though. It was really good. And, um, <laughs> sorry. And, um, I gotta say, that was really good. I enjoyed it. And, um, Superman was with Ruby. And, um, I like how they, uh, um, tr training with Ruby. That was really awesome, though. And then, 
and then all of a sudden you get and then superman says let's just take some rest until tomorrow i gotta say superman was really good for that part but batman you know that you know you know that guy kevin corny the, the legendary he, he was great playing Batman. But for this one, he was great. You know, for Batman Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, Arkham Asylum, and then the Justice League cartoon, Justice League Eliminated cartoon. And all those games and TV shows and movies, though. But I gotta say, he was a legend. But then I told you, remember I told you on my last, on my own video, he died. And I just feel sad about him. The cast. So, like I told you about him, I'm really sad for him. If you haven't seen my, my music video that I did, check it out. So, just want to let you know, check it out. As I was saying about the movie. um, So, they just go up, they... They create, they fight Gr Grim Attack. And then, all of a sudden, there was Kilgore. And I'm like, oh no. Unbelievable. That was insane. And I gotta say, that was, that was insane. Totally insane. But, it was so, so insane. But right now, this part was totally, totally crazy. But you know what? Let me tell you about this. Kilgore is like, you know, like changing, in, you know, the Grimms and everything. You know what I mean? But that was the the first part of one movie. And then to the second part. I gotta say about that. That was really cool though. Well, kind of. And and then and then and, and when the fight the fight was really good though. And and then they changed new worlds. You know, different worlds were in a fight. And I'm like, oh my gosh. They did a really good job for a fight. And then, Kansas, Metropolis, and other places. And during the fight. That was pretty insane, you know what I'm saying? But, I mean, but let me get this straight for you guys that movie was really good i really enjoyed it it's on max i really enjoyed it it bring i can watch it, it again and again because part two is they did a really good job for the justice league green lantern cyborg wonder woman batman the flash Vixen and Superman. But I wish there were their other Justice League. You know, Shazam, Aquaman, and um Satana, Martian Manhunter, and um um, um what's his name? <clears throat> Um, you know what I mean. That's what I mean. But right now, I gotta say, this movie did a really good job. They did a really good job for this movie. So, I'm going to give Justice League X Ruby, the second movie, part two, a... 7 out of 10. Well, the reason why. The reason why is 
I like they I go I like they have new outfits. They have really good change. And and the ending Kilgore continues the Kilgore um, Kilgore just um controls that the um Dr. Malo or something and all that kind of that guy or something or someone else but I gotta say that was a really good though but it was a really good movie I enjoyed it but it was perfect it did a perfect job for this movie and they got new powers and you know what I mean and second of all legends you know what I mean um they have also have uh, um they switch um Ruby I mean team Ruby's powers into justice leagues as powers and outfits too it, it's just a little different you know it's just a little different so I gotta say that was really good I enjoyed it they did the perfect job for adults I like how they become adults as the Justice League better than the teenagers from the part one I just kind of don't you know like it well kind of so I'm going to say I kind of liked it. I do. It was really good. So that's for my review of Justice League X Ruby part I mean X Ruby Superheroes and Hench Enhancement Part 2 review. If you haven't seen this movie, watch it. Watch part 1 first before you see part two and and i'm gonna wrap this up for now make sure you like and subscribe and hit the bell notification and link description and and as always i'm time fly here and as always <laughs> i keep seeing that i'm time fly here take care everyone and peace out